Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that find the length of transverse and conjugate axis, eccentricity, orbits of foci and vertices, length of latest rectum, equations of directrices, or the given hyperbola. 4x squared minus 9y squared is equal to minus 36. Now, before starting the solution of this question, we should know some results. First is, if the equation of the hyperbola is given as x square over a square minus y square over b square is equal to 1, then minus x square over a square plus y square over v square is equal to 1 that is y square over b square minus x square over a square is equal to 1 or you can write x square over a square minus y square over b square is equal to minus 1 is its conjugate hyperbola. Where A and B are the constants. Secondly, for the conjugate hyperbola, the coordinates of the vertices are given as 0, B and 0 minus B and the coordinates of the foci are given as 0 plus minus BE where E is greater than 1 as for the hyperbola eccentricity is greater than 1 then length of the transverse axis is 2B the length of the conjugate axis is 2A then the length of latest rectum is 2a square over b and the equations of directrices are given as y is equal to plus minus b over e also the eccentricity E is equal to square root of B square plus A square whole upon B square. Now these results will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. And now we will start with the solution. Now in the question for the given hyperbola we have to find the length of the transverse and conjugate axis, then the eccentricity, then coordinates of foci, vertices, length of latest rectum, and equations of the directrices. So the equation of the given hyperbola is 4x square minus 9y square is equal to minus 36. And this can be written as 4x square over 36 minus 9y square over 36 is equal to minus 1, which implies x square over 9 minus y square over 4 is equal to minus 1. Now this is the equation of the conjugate hyperbola of the given hyperbola. Now this is of the form of the equation of conjugate hyperbola. Now here 
a square is equal to 9 and b square is equal to 4. Now first of all we will find the length of transverse and conjugate axis for this given hyperbola. Now using these results which are given in the key idea, so the length of the transverse axis is 2b. Now here b square is equal to 4. So b will be equal to plus minus 2. Now we know that length is always positive. So we will consider the positive value of b. So this is equal to 2 into 2 which is equal to 4. Now the length of conjugate axis is 2a which will be equal to 2 into a square is 9 so a is 3 which is equal to 6. Now we can find out the eccentricity by using this formula. Now the eccentricity E of the given hyperbola is equal to square root of b square plus a square whole upon b square. Now a square is 9 and b square is 4. So this is equal to square root of 4 plus 9 whole upon 4 which is equal to square root of 13 by 4 which is equal to root 13 by 2. Now we know that eccentricity of a hyperbola is greater than 1. So here we are considering only the positive sign with 2. Now by using these results we will find the coordinates of vertices and foci. Now the coordinates of foci are given as 0 plus minus BE. So this is equal to 0 plus minus now B square is 4 so it will be plus minus 2 into E which is root 13 by 2 so this is equal to 0 plus minus root 13. Therefore, the coordinates of Fukai are 0 plus minus root 13. Now the coordinates of vertices are 0 plus minus P which is equal to 0. Now B square is 4. So this will be plus minus 2 Therefore, the coordinates of vertices are 0 plus minus 2. Now, we will find the length of latest sector by using this formula. Now, the length of latest sector is equal to 2a square by b, which is equal to 2 into a square, which is 9, over B. Now here also as length is positive and we are having B square is equal to 4 that means B is equal to plus minus 2 so we will consider only the positive sign as length is positive. So here B is 2 therefore the length of latest sector will be equal to 9. And now we will find the equations of directrices by using this result. So the equations of the directrices are given by y is equal to plus minus b over e. Now the eccentricity is root 13 by 2 and b square is equal to 4. 
So the equations of the directrices will be y is equal to plus minus 2 over root 30 by 2. This implies y is equal to plus minus 4 by root 13. So we have got length of transverse axis is equal to 4. Length of conjugate axis for the given hyperbola is equal to 6. Eccentricity is equal to root 13 by 2. Coordinates of foci are 0 plus minus root 13 and coordinates of vertices are 0 plus minus 2. Length of the lattice vector is equal to 9 and the equations of the directrices are y is equal to plus minus 4 over root 13. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.